All right, here we go. University of Yoda One. 22 RRE RTE oil pumps. Iason always, nothing else. And here we go. First, we're gonna check for any debris in the pump. We're gonna check real close down in that hole. Basically everywhere. We're gonna clean this thing out real good. We'll show you. Here we go. There's a front seal that's been soaking in oil. Excellent idea. Makes it install a lot easier. Press. Sometimes we gotta go over here to the press. This is one of those times. The big old 60 ton press. We're probably gonna put all 60 tons on this poor little oil pump. Nah, probably not. I'm gonna put like 10 pounds on it. Seal installed nice and even. Back to the workbench. We're getting some assembly lube in the oil pump rotor for two reasons. One is to prevent any damage on startup while the oil works its way up to the oil pump and two to help that happen faster there's a lot of air in there and it has a hard time pulling a pulling a vacuum to get that oil up into the oil pump so this kind of helps seal everything up and helps that oil get up the pickup tube a lot faster And then the best part of all. We find that the oil pump O-rings are a little bit too thin. Yes, even the ones from Toyota. So here's what we've been doing for years. You gross. But not near as gross as an oil pump leak. We got the oil pump drive gear. This is a dual row chain, so this has got the, the little stubby gear here. Make sure you have the appropriate gear. Make sure you have one. I'm gonna lay that O-ring in there. Well we're not, but Shelby is. We'll install the oil pump in about 15 minutes when Shelby gets all that silicone off his hands. There we go. Oil pump's nice down in place. Work on some brand new bolts here. bolt the one right here right under the oil pump right under your timing tag top bolt of the oil pump look there that is a through bolt hole it goes directly into the timing chain area in the front of the block and if you don't get a little bit of silicone on those threads there's a good chance it will leak oil we don't like oil leaks
this bolt right here, the one that could leak oil, is also, if you were to look straight through that hole, you would see the timing chain tensioner back in there. So if you use a bolt that's too long, it will pin the timing tensioner and cause many problems. So there you go. One more lesson on 22RRE RTE oil pump preparation and installation.